Azerbaijan GP, Max Feshtarpen misses top 5 as Charles Leclerc mounts FP2 fight back. Charles Leclerc went from further woes to fastest in the second Baku practice session, as Max Feshtarpen found himself half a second off the pace. An FP1 crash was followed by major handling issues for Leclerc in FP2, which saw him stuck in the Ferrari garage. But once he got back out there on the softs, he went to the very top of the timings, with Sergio Perez and Lewis Hamilton in close pursuit. Charles. Leclerc P1 as dramatic Azerbaijan GP race weekend continues, Feshtarpen, fastest in FP1, was first out as the light went green, armed with the medium's tires, as was Leclerc after Ferrari got his SF24 back in working order. Following his FP1 date with the barriers, Williams needed a bit more time to get Franco Colapinto's FW46 back on track, Leclerc quickly put himself top of the timings, though was not enjoying life in the Ferrari, claiming something was bent, as Ferrari continued to look for the issue. Lewis Hamilton meanwhile was calling into box, saying he could not see with his windshield, while Mercedes teammate George Russell was stuck in the garage as a power unit change took place, Leclerc's frustrations were starting to escalate, as he declared it impossible that Ferrari could not see anything on the data. He duly returned to the pits, with Perez now leading a Red Bull 1-2, Feldstarpen survived a major scare though. Locking up and coming to a stop inches from the wall at turn 5, while Hülkenberg was getting upset with Perez who thinks we're racing through the tight second sector, as the session ticked towards its halfway mark, Carlos Sainz used the soft tyre to pop up to P1 on a 1 minute and 44.323 seconds, while a human wall had formed around Leclerc's sister Ferrari as investigations continued. Further crucial time lost for Leclerc with the qualifying simulations beginning. Lando Norris was on for P1, until encountering a slow-moving Pierre Gasly threw the kinks back onto the straight, bringing that attempt to an end. No such dramas for Feshtarpen, though he was forced to settle for P2, 0.079s a drift of signs, after that first soft tyre push. Oscar Piastri proceeded to muscle his way between signs and Feshtarpen, the low, setting sun was causing visibility issues for Feshtarpen, who took to the runoff at turn 7 but Perez was flying on the softs as he returned to P1, almost half a second clear of signs, Leclerc was at last back out on track, but still was not having it all his own way as he found the turn 8 runoff, while signs was checking out the turn 3 escape route. Colapinto was fortuned to withstand a heavy whack of the inside barrier at the ultra-tight turn 8 ninths, Hamilton kept his Mercedes on the road to take over as Perez's closest challenger, falling just 600s short of the Mexicans 1 minute and 43.90 seconds, as focus transitioned towards the race simulations, Leclerc was running out of sync on the softs, and doing so successfully as he took over top spot with a 1 minute and 43.84 seconds. Sainz was having more adventures down escape roads, this time at turn 7, while Bottas bailed out at turn 1. Turn 2 was catching Lance Stroll out, Russell had made it out onto the track, but was called back to the pits due to an issue with the car as the checkered flag soon flew to end the session. FP2 times, 1 Charles Leclerc Ferrari 1 minute and 43 point for 84 seconds, 2 Sergio Perez Red Bull Racing 0.006, 3 Lewis Hamilton Mercedes 0.066, for Carla Sainz Ferrari 0.466, 5 Oscar Piastri McLaren 0.499, 6 Max Verstappen N Red Bull Racing 0.545, 7 Lance Stroll Aston Martin 0.609, 8 Nico Hülkenberg Haas F1 Team 0.991, 9 George Russell Mercedes 1.052. 10 Oliver Behrman Haas F1 Team 1.063, 11 Yuki Tsunoda RB 1.161, 12 Fernando Alonso Aston Martin 1.199, 13 Alexander Alban Williams 1.253, 14 Franco Cola Pinto. Williams 1.265, 15 Valtteri Bottas Kick Zauber 1.301, 16 Daniel Ricciardo RB 1.572, 17 Lando Norris McLaren 1.672, 18 Pierre Gasly Alpine 1.907, 19 Esteban Ocon Alpine 2.326, 20 Ju Guan Yu Kick Zauber 2.463.